Yo, what's up, guys? Dimes HD here, and today Cristiano Ronaldo has had his contract mutually terminated by Manchester United. Um, I'm gonna give my reaction and my thoughts on this. Cristiano Ronaldo has come out with a statement. The only reason I didn't make a video earlier is because I was at work, but I saw it. Cristiano Ronaldo came out with a statement. Manchester United have come out with their club statement. And now, now that they've um, mutually terminated Ronaldo's contract, it's come out in the last hour, now the Glazers are open to selling Manchester United. So, basically, they got rid of Cristiano Ronaldo, mutually terminated his contract, and now they're open to selling Man United. Was this a pity fall by Ronaldo to get the Glazers out of Man United? Because, this is how I see it, right? Maybe, um, I don't know. Maybe... Maybe this was, um, maybe, maybe, maybe Ronaldo had a plan in place already, man. Um, but yeah, I find it very funny. As soon as they mutually terminate his contract, the Glazers are now ready to sell. It, 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 it happened like four hours ago and an hour ago, they're ready to sell now. I mean, seriously, man. Seriously? Yeah. This is stupid. This is stupid, man. Um, on both ends, um, Cristiano Ronaldo is out of Manchester United now by mutual consent, and we're going to see who we're going to sign in January, because I'm really curious on what striker we're going to sign, because we're going to need a striker, Martial's injured all the time, um, Rashford can play number nine, but in big games we need a better striker than Rashford, because he's not really a striker, Rashford's more of a winger, so we're going to need a number nine in January, 100%. And it's going to be real interesting to see where Ronaldo goes after the World Cup. Um, so, yeah. Ronaldo out of his contract at Man United. Now the Glazers are ready to sell. <laughs> so, all the damage they've done over the past 20 years. Oh, oh, it's 2022. And if you notice, I think they know something is coming. Some type of recession or something. Because a lot of these guys have been selling these teams. Why are they selling now? They know something's coming. Why are they selling now? Why now? Why not four or five years ago? They had the money four or five years ago. They could have sold four years ago. Why before 2023, now it's time to sell? Why? I find that very interesting. Do they know something we don't? Something is coming because why are they open to selling Man United now? Why? I find that really, really interesting. You know, they wouldn't have done this before. Now, all of a sudden, in November of 2022, now, now it's time to sell. Oh, we're open to selling now. I find it really damning, honestly, man. After they terminated Ronaldo's contract. Let's go over to the internet scene. As you can see right here, um, breaking news. The Glazers family are open to selling Manchester United. United have released a statement revealing they are commencing a process to explore strategic alternatives for the club. Now, all of a sudden... Now, all of a sudden, they want to explore strategic opportunity, alternatives. Now, all of a sudden, they want to sell. That's crazy. Here we go. It's just Manchester United's club statement. Um, okay, so this is the Glazers' release statement. Manchester United, one of the most successful historic sports clubs in the world, announces today that the company's board of directors... The board is commencing a process to explore strategic alternatives for the club. The process is designed to enhance the club's future growth with the ultimate goal of positioning the club to, cap to capitalize on opportunities both on and off the pitch commercially. Both, oh, both on the pitch and commercially. As part of this process, the board will consider all strategic alternatives, including new investment into the club, a sale, or other transactions involving the company. This will include an assessment of several initiatives to strengthen the club, including stadium and infrastructure re redevelopment and expansion of the club's commercial operations on a global scale, each in the context of enhancing the long-term success of the club's men's, women's, academy teams, and bringing benefits to fans and other stakeholders. Um, executive co-chairman and directors are Arvon... Avram Glazer and Joe Glazer said the strength of Manchester United rests on the passion of the loyalty in our global community of 1.1 billion fans and followers. As we seek to continue building on the club's history of success, the board has authorized 
a thorough evaluation of strategic alternatives. We will evaluate all options to ensure that we best serve our fans at Manchester United, blah, 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 blah. The Rain Group is acting as the company's exclusive financial advisor and Laftham and Watkins LLP is legal counsel to the company. Rothschild, I've heard that before. That sounds familiar. Rothschild, isn't that guy from... Oh, no, that's Epstein. Rothschild, that sounds... That's that's something. I don't know what that is, but I, I'm not surprised. Once again, all this stuff is linked. Rothschild & Co. is acting as an exclusive financial advisor to the Glazer family shareholders. There can be no assurance that the review being undertaken will result in any transaction involving the company. Interest United does not intend to make any further announcements until the board has a specific... Yeah, yeah, whatever. Whatever. Now, all of a sudden, it's time to sell. Why are they trying to sell now? Why are they trying to sell now? That's crazy. Now it's time to sell now, right? Cristiano Ronaldo coming out with his statement after his contract has been terminated. Following conversations with Manchester United, we have mutually agreed to end our contract early. I love Manchester United and I love the fans. That will never, ever change. However, it feels like the right time for me to seek a new challenge. I wish the team every success for the remainder of the season and for the future. So, um, Manchester United come up with their official statement. Cristiano Ronaldo is to leave Manchester United by mutual agreement with immediate effect. The club thanks him for his immense contribution across two spells at Old Trafford. Whatever, man. Once again, I find this very, very funny. Now all of a sudden they're coming out with quotes. They're coming out talking about now, now it's time to sell. I find that very, very strange. Why are they trying to sell now? Why now? Before 2023. They could have they could have released this in January. Why is it right now in, in the middle of November, during the World Cup? This is all going on during the World Cup. And I'm going to make a video on that World Cup thing as well with that Argentina game. I didn't forget about that. Because that right there is stupid. But, back to this. Why are they trying to sell now, man? Think a lot. Think bigger. Think it's bigger than Man United. It's bigger than this company. Because it's a company to them. You see how they said it in the statement? This is a company. Manchester United LLC. This is a company. NYSE is a stock company. This is what they think of this. This is money to them. Like Ronaldo said, they don't, and a lot of the players probably say it as well, they don't have football IQ. They don't know football. They know money. They, they don't know football. And this is why the club has been falling by the wayside like it has. Now all of a sudden, it's November 2022. Oh, we're, put, we're, we're discussing putting it up for sale now. No, man, something is coming. Uh, something's coming because why are they selling it now? They could have sold it last year, the year before. Why right now? Keep that in mind. There will be more stuff to develop on this sale of Man United, but they're not. They're, I don't think it'll get sold anytime soon because who's going to buy Man United right now? Who has the money to buy Man United? Maybe you, you got to think about it. All the billionaires in the world, right? For one, you got to find one that's in the football or in the soccer and that wants to invest in the company. Two, that's like maybe 2,000, 3,000 people on the planet that, that could probably buy Man United out of 7 billion, maybe two to 3,000 people. That's a small percentage of people. That's 0.1%. If any of that, that's like point 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 of 1%. So you got to find the buyer. But this right here... They terminate his contract, and then two, three hours later, now they're open to selling. Th this right here is whatever, man. Th this is nonsense right here. Contract terminated. Now it's time for the Glazers to sell now. This th this right here is something I've never seen before. Th this is getting very interesting. And then all the other stuff that's going on. And it's really funny. Why is this going on during the World Cup? Why all this news and information, Ronaldo having interviews, all this stuff is going on during the World Cup. And then you got the World Cup stuff, too, with that, man. Really? I, I, bro, right now, right now, it's hot right now, man. This is ridiculous, man. Honestly, man. But it's a shame to see Ronaldo go, man. It's a shame. It's a shame, man. But we already knew he was going to go. As soon as he did that interview, I already knew he was, his contract was going to get terminated. That's why when I saw it, I was like, well, it was coming anyway. I thought they were going to do it in January. 
But no, they, they went on and did it now. And now three hours later, they're talking about selling the club. Let me know what you think of that down below. I'm telling you, there's something coming, bro. Why are they selling it now? Why now? I mean, yes, it, it makes sense because they've already made their money and done all this stuff. But they already made their money a year ago, two years ago. They're, they're, they're set. They're good. Why are they selling it now? Do they see something we don't? Do they know something we don't? Maybe they do. Maybe they don't. Let me know down below in the comment section down below what you think about Ronaldo's contract getting terminated and the Glazers having Manchester United up for sale. It's me, but I'm just you guys, and I'm out, man. Peace.